Hey guys, Jivin here. So in today's video, I'm going to be sharing to you guys how to properly style your hair, either using your comb, a brush, or your bare hands. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. If you like what you see, be sure to smash that subscribe button and turn on post notifications to never miss a brand new video again. Now everyone is different because everyone's hair type is different. Some people have curly hair, some people have thicker hair. For Asian guys like me, we have thicker hair follicles, so it just sticks out like a porcupine. And the only reason it's not sticking out right now is because it's so long that gravity pulls it down. We have so many options out there right now to style your hair. It's important that you develop your own styling method. You can pretty much buy combs anywhere you go. You know, you can buy like a dollar or two dollar comb like from a dollar store and that will work as well. But when you comb your hair with a cheaper quality comb, you might for example get split ends because it's made of um, cheaper quality. So yeah, for combs, it's meant to give you a slicker kind of look just because like for example, you wanna part your hair. So with a comb, it just parts it really nicely to give you that slick back look. For example, like this. Combs are also good to untangle your hair after the shower. So yeah, you can just untangle your hair like this. One thing bad about the comb, especially if you want to comb your wet hair, is that it could actually pull out your hair. So that's why not many guys use it that much anymore. They use a brush. As for using a brush, it's actually really nice because it creates more volume on your hair, making you look like you have more hair. This is especially beneficial for guys that has thinning out hair. So you know, it makes it really nice and creates some volume. So let's say you want to blow dry your hair upwards like this. You blow dry it while using this comb and that will almost guarantee that you will create more volume in your hair. Last but not least, you can style your hair using your own fingers. The best part about this method, it's all free. You know, everyone has fingers. To style your hair using your fingers, you just go like this basically. If you have shorter hair, all you have to do is just put some products a little bit and then just go like that just to create a natural feel look. When using your fingers, there's no sharp lines created, so it just creates a natural feel. This is also good as well as it doesn't really damage your hair. You're not really pulling anything, especially when you use the combs. So personally, I use all three methods, but the one I use the most common is just using my fingers. It's because like I have the tubal hairstyle, so like when I wake up or shower, Basically, right now, without any products, I can just go out like this. Basically, use my hands just to like style it a little bit like this. Make sure my bangs are all even. And yeah, that's basically how I go out. Occasionally, I use the comb just to make it more smooth and more slick. However, using the brush as well will help you create more volume. So I'll just do it a little bit in the middle right here. just to create more volume to your hair and make you look like you have more hair than you have. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, let me know down in the comments below and check back next time.